been suspended today. Jamaican international Dickoy Williams comes in for his first start for Toronto FC as we take you through the lineup that Aaron Vinter has selected this afternoon for his team. No Nana Atacor today, he's out injured as well. So a lot of changes for Toronto at the back. And Dickoy Williams' arrival, one of three changes from the defeat to DC. Dan Gargan returns at right back. And after missing the last two games with injury, Alan Gordon is fit again. He'll lead the three man strike force that also includes Javier Martina and Jacob Peterson. Without a defeat since the opening day, Columbus coach Robert Vazija names an unchanged side. The back four has started every single game so far this season, anchored by the crew's new captain, Chad Marshall. Alongside him in the center of defense is former Toronto FC defender Julius James. Gordon does well, uses his strength to come away with that one, and then finds Julian de Guzman. De Guzman's cross just a little too high for Peterson. Chani's flick, brought down by Alan Gordon. Space here for Toronto. Martina trying to get round the back of Miranda. It's a race to the ball, and Martina gets there first. Foreman and supported. Martina can find him. He can. The South African with the cross in, just over to the back post, and then the shot from Alan Gordon straight at Will Hesman. Gordon is having a battle with James on halfway. Great ball from Gordon to find Javier Martina. Chad Marshall tries to get back. Martina with a shot saved by Will Hesman. Another break involving Alan Gordon and Martina. And this time it's a corner. Dickley Williams standing strong, but Renteria manages to get there. Takes the ball off Williams. Back it comes to Rogers. Was always curling away from goal from Robbie Rogers after the giveaway by Dickoy Williams. Burns and Martinez squaring up, and this is getting a little ugly. The assistant referee in there as well to help David Gant to the ref from Alberta sort things out. Bubbling over between these two Trillium Cup rivals. A booking for Tony Charney, also a yellow for Burns. De Guzman gets the ball back from Gordon over the top for Tony Charney. Tony Charney opens the scoring for Toronto FC. His first goal since his move from New York. The ball played over the top. Charney round the back of the defense. The cool left foot finish. De Guzman gets the assist. He took it well, Tony Charney. The Cameroon midfielder gets only his second career Major League Soccer goal. And wouldn't you know it, the first one came against Columbus as well. The referee having a word with Charney. I wonder if it's about the celebration. He's already been booked. And the referee reaching to his pocket shows a yellow and then a red. Charney's afternoon ended. He went over the boards towards the fans in celebration. Duca. Wide it goes to Miranda. The cross in from Sebastian Miranda. Renteria with a header. It's a good finish from Emilio Renteria as the Columbus crew make their man advantage count back on level terms three minutes into the second half. The cross coming in from the right-hand side, and Emilio Renteria, the first one to react. <laughs> it's Robbie Rogers. Rogers has Heidemann in the middle, and a challenge from Gargan puts the ball behind for another Columbus corner. The crew stepping up the pressure over the last couple of minutes. Dealt with by Dan Gargan. Fry still has to come and try and get there. Leon says the referee as it bobbles about Renteria could have directed towards goal. Fry felt he should have had a free kick. Rogers inside to Billy Duca. Duca! Rogers wants it played to the right. That's where it goes. Mendoza makes the run into the middle. Comes to Heinemann at the back post. Heinemann! Feel he should have done better. Platter for Tiurasovsky. And here is Jao Platter. Platter will run at Marshall. 
He's got support from Urosovsky and Eckersley. Goes one way, then the other. And then, in the end, it might still come to Plata. And here we see João Plata. He almost tested Hesma when the ball came back to him. Nervous last few moments for Toronto FC and their fans. Gavin's delivery. The header from Marshall straight at Stefan Fry. And Plata has made a run forward. Fry hits Rosmeer with the ball downfield. And Rosmeer will get a yellow card. Fry wanted to get things going quickly. Rosmeer and James protesting that the Columbus man couldn't get out of the way. They are still yet to beat Columbus. It's a point for Toronto against Columbus, having played the second half, a man down.